you want to stay at the Waldorf Astoria Maldives, you are forced to pay $800 for a 45 minute boat ride. It is incredibly luxurious, but is this worth $800 per person? When you're first welcome to board, you're already connected to the Wi Fi and they have some snacks, granola bars, little chocolate cakes, and some nuts waiting for you. This is actually not a private ride, so you better choose your seat wisely and hope that you're the first ones on there. We were then given a cold towel to cool down. The entire staff that greeted us waved goodbye. Now, they do offer complimentary champagne, and this is totally unlimited, but this is about a $40 bottle. It was okay, but nothing special. And if the sea is too choppy, then you aren't able to drink champagne or have anything besides water and the snacks. If you're tired from your trip, then you can go down into one of the many rooms that is on board the yacht. There are two rooms that you can sleep in. They have these little slippers here and a place to sit so you can get a little bit more private. Of course, this is first come, first serve, so if somebody else gets it before you, then you can't go. There's also a bathroom with a shower on board. You have a lot of options to freshen up and you can go outside and enjoy the water. For one way, we actually were alone and that was lovely. We could have coffee and we had a lot of privacy. For the other way, there was a child on board and she was pretty loud, so you get what you get. As I mentioned, it is unlimited free champagne 